Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Juan, and I'm here to let you know what's going on this week at Myrtle Beach Games. That's right, it's pre-release weekend, so let's check out the schedules for the Magic the Gathering Dominaria United pre-release weekend. Over at Myrtle Beach Games of Conway, the Dominaria United pre-release schedule is going to be Friday at 7 p.m., Saturday at 6 p.m., and Sunday at 4 p.m. At Myrtle Beach Games and Comics, aka Sakasti, we're going to get things started at 3 p.m., again at 7 p.m., and then once again at midnight. On Saturday, again, we're going to do 3 p.m., 7 p.m., at midnight, only this time it's going to be Plane Chase. And on Sunday, you're going to have 2 p.m. and 7 p.m. Now, if you have any questions about any of these pre release events, you can always reach out to us anytime on Facebook. In Teables, you'll take the role of a boba store owner tasked with making drinks with all of the required ingredients. Nemesis is a semi-cooperative game where you and your crewmates must survive an infested ship and make it safely back to Earth. Nemesis Lockdown is the first standalone expansion for the Nemesis game. During the game, players will be taken to a totally new location, a secret base on the planet Mars. The Dune game Arrakis, Dawn of the Fremen. Spice. He knows about the spies. Now you, you control a tribe of warriors struggling to gather resources. The spice menage. Develop weapons and harness the power of the sandworms for battle. Are you ready to step up your flesh and blood game? Also in at Myrtle Beach Games, we got the awesome Dragon Shield flesh and blood sleeves. Now you can't conquer a planet without an army. So the Power Rangers Hero of the Grid, Merciless Minions 1, allows you to unleash those armies to weaken those pesky Power Rangers so then the big bosses can come in and finish the job. The Dungeons & Dragons Campaign Case Terrain is the perfect tool for any dungeon master to set up their frontier encounters, their dark dungeons, or even their big city adventures. The pirate captain lands on an abandoned island and leaves you 45 minutes to search for the treasure of the pirate buzzard. With this game, you'll be able to recreate the atmosphere of an escape room right in your home. In this version, you are tasked with finding Professor Flynn in this jungle paradise filled with dinosaurs. Now again, you have 45 minutes to complete this task. This quiz game from Denmark contains 3,000 questions and actually gets its name for the German word Besserwisser. I'm probably mispronouncing that, but it means know-it-all. Do you know it all? A silly monster lives in your house. Box Monster eats everything in your room. Your pizza, your grandmother's false teeth. And as you can imagine, the stomach isn't feeling so good after that. So it's up to you to get rid of all the things that he ate. Zombicide Black Plague brings the zombie apocalypse back into a fantastical medieval environment. The arcane powers of the necromancers have unleashed the zombie horde, and it's up to you and your fellow survivors to not only survive, but to take back this realm. Name for the pack that surrounds the area. Zombicide Black Plague Wolfsburg adds new tiles, enemies, equipment, heroes to the game Zombicide Black Plague. Green Horde is the sequel to Zombicide Black Plague. You're going to be going back to the same fantastical medieval environment. This time, it is infested with infected ogres and goblins. And that's going to be where we wrap up today. So if you're watching on YouTube, go ahead, give us a like, subscribe if you haven't already. If you're on Facebook, give us a like, leave a comment. I'm Juan, and that's what was happening at Murder Beach Games this week. We'll catch you guys next time.